DJ Bella Bip John Lucy Warren Gabby Reese the Spot Charlotte Danny Emma Rocky We'll go to Shakespeare High School is great, but breaks are better We all meet to mess about Here you go, Lucy. Leo the Lion. Today is the day you must say exactly what's on your mind. Tell people what you think and you will feel much better. OK. JJ, you are the most annoying brother. You're better in smells you eat with your mouth open. And just because dogs lick themselves clean, it doesn't mean it's OK for you to do it. <laughs> you know what? I do feel better. <laughs> Dude, you lick yourself clean. Mm -hmm. Doing behind my ears is a nightmare. Wow, you look like you ate too many carrots. <laughs> Miss Sigmog says orange is my lucky colour today. Bella, Miss Bird is ill, so we've got a free period after lunch. Uh -huh. So, where do you stand on astrology, Emma? I'm sceptical, but then again I would be. I'm a Capricorn. You know, I reckon Bella would do anything if Mystic Mog told her to. This is the face of a man with a plan. Or a doofus. It's hard to tell. <laughs> Hey Charlotte, how's tomorrow's school paper coming on? Pretty good. I'm just waiting to find out if Lucy's broken the school record for the most grapes in her mouth at once. It looks like I've got my front page. Oh, sorry. Okay, so how is knocking all of Charlotte's stuff on the floor going to help you go out with Bella? It won't. But switching Mystic Mog's horoscope for the one I wrote is going to help a lot. <laughs> I've just got an A in maths. Today really is my lucky day. And tomorrow is mine. <laughs> Astrology? Bella, you don't really believe in all that rubbish, do you? <laughs> Mystic Mog is never up. Look, today she says I'm going to meet the man of my dreams. <laughs> really? Let me see. Yeah, apparently he'll be wearing a red jacket. Hi, Bella. <laughs> like the jacket? <laughs> OK, so lots of people have got red jackets. It also says he'll be a magnificent sportsman. Hey, JJ, that was a great goal you scored at lunchtime. <laughs> And the other 56 were good too. You are one. Turn the card over. <laughs> Magnificent sportsman. OK, it must just be a coincidence. Mystic Mog can't mean JJ. It also says the man of my dreams will have a Scottish terrier called McDog. JJ, Mum says don't forget to take McDog for a walk. I wouldn't normally help, but he promised to start showering eating with his mouth shut. <laughs> I can't believe it. JJ is the man of my dreams. Read the bottom bit. If you don't have lunch with him tomorrow, your hair will go frizzy. See you tomorrow. I don't believe it. Neither do I. Bella, I have a confession to make. I am Mystic Mog and I did not write any of this. I am so going to get JJ. Hold on. I've got a better idea. <laughs> Guess who? I don't know, but they haven't washed their hands in a while. It's the man of your dreams! JJ, I'm so glad you came. To be honest, I didn't think you'd be brave enough. Don't be silly, I... What do you mean, brave enough? Haven't you read your horoscope in today's paper? If you go on a lunch date today, you'll be plagued with bad luck. JJ, you've been picked for the school cross-country team. JJ, Mr Hurst accidentally parked on your bike. <laughs> JJ, Mum says my dog did a wee in your bedroom. According to Mystic Mark, it'll keep getting worse unless you cancel your lunch date. But uh, you don't care because you're the big, brave man of my dreams. <laughs> yeah, um, about lunch. Actually, I'm a bit busy. Brain check, yeah? Later. <laughs> How's tomorrow's horoscope coming on? Not too well. I think I've lost my gift for predicting the future. I'm sure you haven't. You're probably just trying too hard. I tell you what, why don't you just relax, tell me what you see, and I'll write it down. OK. Let's start with Leo. I see Leo walking along. Leo hasn't noticed that there's a bucket on the floor and trips over it. <laughs> That's odd. Um, anything else? How about Taurus? The Torian will get walloped by Leo with a bag. <laughs> That's weird. Um, Gemini? I see Gemini giving Shakespeare a new hat. <sighs> what? That doesn't make any sense. Sorry, Emma, you really are rubbish at predicting the future. I told you. 